Namaste. Hello, my dear beautiful Aquarius. How are you all doing? I welcome you all to my channel. This is Shivansh. All right. And if you are new to my channel, please do like, share and subscribe. All right. And I would like to tell you, Aquarius, that I have not been working uh, since pandemic started. And this is the only way that I can uh, make my bread and butter. And uh, I'm not doing good as, as of now. So please do subscribe to my channel. That will really, really help me to grow. OK. And make my bread and butter. That will be a really big, big contribution from your end. And I do thank you for that. OK. All right, uh, Aquarius, I'm going to do your <clears throat> March reading. So let's see what uh, you can expect coming your way in the month of March or going forward. Whenever you see these uh, readings, that's when is the right time. All right, and if you are divinely guided and uh, guided to watch this reading, then stay. There is a message for you. All right. Curious. There is a lot of transformations that have been taken place. Uh, lots of planetary transits been taken place, and I'm sure you are going through some big energy shifts at your end. Big metamorphosis taking place, which is bringing you to your own divine qualities of who you are, and you are going through some tower moments at this point of time. Sudden emotional breakdown where you are losing all your grip over your life and now you are looking for some kind of healing and when i say that this card just came up which is surya the sun god all right and it has one two three four five six six is the half horse it's five horse you know you might have been going through certain kind of changes and upheavals in your life for the last five long years or five and a half long years okay it says, let us sing the glories of the sun god whose beauty reveals that of the hibiscus flower. I bow to him, the greatly and uh, effulgent son of Kaishapa, who is the enemy of darkness and destroyer of all sins. The blessing that uh, holds this card is honor, status and fame, reunion, reunion with one's beloved freedom from disease and ailments, general vitality, respect and power. How beautiful is that? I mean, what I feel for you is that uh, the pile of the group of people that I'm connecting to right now after looking through this card is that, you know, you people have gone through such kind of a transformations in your life that uh, you are now to a place where you you when you look back and see yourself you see you are completely completely a transformed human being you know you are not the same person anymore that you, the, the way you used to be once upon a time all right and if you're here um to get some clarity what i feel is that during this process of time you have lost all your health wealth happiness relationship possibly you have put at stack or possibly you have sacrificed everything all right everything of yours you have sacrificed everything of yours to the divine to the to the universe all right and you have completely completely surrendered yourself to the universe all right and you are asking the universe to guide to navigate your path moving forward going forward all right that's the kind of an energy that i'm feeling which will take you to a place where you Whatever you felt that has been lost from you, you know, or was taken from you by the universe will get restored. Your honor, name, fame, health, happiness, abundance, uh, relationship, because we saw that, right? Reunion with beloved, honor and fame, right? Uh, some kind of toxicity is going to take place. Uh, I mean, uh, will be taken out from your life that has been placed, inflicted in your life for a long time. Healing is coming. Healing is coming. And you are still feeling that healing, you know. That's what I feel. All right. <clears throat> if you are seeing a lot of blue color or uh, green color, then that's a confirmation for you. Even yellow and brown. I feel that all the colors are present out here, I believe. Uh, with this healing, I believe your entire human system uh, from the seven chakras to kundalini to nari to uh, the intellectual right and the left brain of yours, the yin and yang energy within you, the ardhana ratio within you is going to get restored, my dear beautiful Aquarius. That's what I highly feel for you. That means kundalini is rising at this point of time. You may have, you may encounter certain kind of orbs 
you know moving around you you will have a strong connection with your uh, spirit guides uh, you know some birds may be chirping at your window or your door every now and then all right huge downloads huge nudge from the universe you know because something major is going to move move from one dimension to the other dimension let's put it this way you are going to take a leap a jump all right and divine has your back on this divine absolutely has your back uh, you know on this and uh, divine is the one who is navigating your journey uh, you know clearing all all your path all all right and any kind of toxicity from the past that is lingering on with you right now you know divine is working at your back to remove those all right so one find is suddenly it is possible that you will wake up and you will see things has been changed your belief system has been changed you know lots of um, movements that you will observe all right maybe small small you may not pay that much of an attention but if you pay uh, very close attention be more vigilant about it be very very conscious and thoughtful about it all the time enlighten and awaken about it you will start to feel that how abundance comes to your life in small small shapes and sizes all right and anything that comes out to you right now that did not seem like oh it never happened that way but now you will feel that this is happening that way because because of the changes that you have done in your life to be where you are today all right something beautiful marvelous is taking place in your life that's what i feel this is the highest degree of card in ter traditional tarot deck right the sun and here we got the card and the hierophant that is atma all right if you're lately seeing a lot of v v roman v or you know alpha alphabet v that that's a confirmation for you or s <clears throat> all right and i believe uh, that uh, at this point of time your energy is absolutely absolutely tapped into you know the soul power all right your energy is absolutely in your soul power your life is in is, right now is in soul power right now okay that's what i strongly believe and to what i was already telling you your belief system is changing uh, you know uh, lots of things are changing in your life major changes and as i said with the hair of card it's about uh, you know uh, commitment right it's about commitment if somebody was fearing commitment in the past now with this card which says reunion with beloved maybe some kind of commitment marriage is taking place all right marriage is taking place and the bottom of the card is um, bottom of the deck is ace of cup and i would like to take this card for sure in this reading because this is very prominent for me and we will see what this card has to say uh, two of pentacles and <clears throat> all right yeah i mean this uh, the the uh, the group of people that i'm connected to right now is a very very uh, spiritual being very much like this a this is a pile of people who loves love let me put it this way okay these are the kind of people uh, you know their their heart is overflowing with love overflowing with emotions overflowing with commitments vows you know they are doing every bit of them you know to to bring change into their surroundings into their life into people's life you know that they, they come in contact with every now and then you know they 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 pour out their love their empathy their sympathy their kindness their generosity to to the to the people around they are the sun right they vibe in that soul energy they carry that ace of cup that has been given to this souls this group of soul this ace of cup by the divine they are full of um, love and grace and gratitude for people around them they see everyone so highly you know this means a lot for for this uh, this soul this group of people all right and when they are doing this nobody knows around them how much they are in pain you know even this is a group of people no matter how much pain and struggle suffering they are going through you know no matter how many times their inner child has been stabbed at their back and no many times how many times this uh, this person has died while doing for others but they are the group of people who will still go miles 
to you know give the best of the best suggestion that can heal somebody else's life because they are the son they are the one who knows to tamper you know they have all the higher knowledge and wisdom they have that lantern in their hand to show up to the universe the door to love all right they are so much innocent so much full of uh, passion love uh, emotions empathy sympathy grace and gratitude kindness within them with their higher knowledge, balancing abilities, you know, taking care uh, abilities, you know, that nurturing, higher knowledge, wisdom, all these divine qualities this person possess, you know, within them, the soul, this soul group possess in them, you know, despite all odds, this group of people has stood up tall. Let me put it this way. This group of people has stood up tall with this ace of cup overflowing of emotions in their life. All right, but the people that they have dealt with this kind of an energy was toxic, full of pain, regret, remorse. You know, people, those who don't know how to decide every time they are juggling in their life and the kind of an energy they kept vibing. This is the same kind of an energy you kept receiving at your end. Despite all the love that you have shown, the kindness, the being humble, you know, generosity to somebody else, you know, pouring out your cup, your innocence to somebody else's bullshit. All right, let me, I'm sorry about that. But this is what I feel for this group of people that for all this, what they have done for other people at the end, they have, all they have uh, attracted towards their life is pain, you know, because you are a healer. This group of people is a big time healer with all these blue colors, with this root chakra balancing energy with the sun. You truly are a healer. If you walk up in the room, Somebody will absolutely look you, uh, turn at you one more time. You know, you're not a person to be ignored or overlooked or it's not like a person who will not be noticed, all right? You are no, you are absolutely beam of a sun. You know, when you enter a room, people will definitely look up to you because that's the kind of an energy that you carry being that soul of that you have within you who has given you that identity of who you are today, whatever is your name, however people knows you, all right? People knows you as a beautiful person, but the energy that you deal with, you deal with people like more, you are more like a counselor to everybody where you are giving suggestions, you are giving guidance, you are giving motivations, you are trying to inspire, you know, no matter whatever uh, BS you have gone through in your life, no, uh, you know, even if you don't have a relationship, you will motivate somebody that, oh, you need to believe in love, okay, you need to, don't give up, you know, even if you are giving up on yourself, but you will always make sure that, <coughs> excuse me about that. I'm curious that you are too much like giving, you know, you are too much giving, all right, and you really have given a lot to balance certain energies in somebody else's existence as well, all right, because you want to give the best to the universe, you want to give the best to the world, you want to give best, you want to share your cup of love with other people around, all right. And when you do that, when you keep vibing with that energy, I'm curious, let me tell you. All right, let me tell you, whatever you put out to the universe, universe always multiplies it and it gives back to, um, back to you, right? And this is what is going to take place in your life now when you are watching me on this reading, okay? Within the next 14 days, maybe 11 days, 9 days, 3 days, 2 days, 5 days, something major may take place in your life because this is a very, very fast moving energy. It is not like that, uh, you know, this is, uh, this is a long overdue energy for you, for sure, this healing, you know, this uh, balancing of energies in, in your life, offer, you know, higher knowledge, wisdom, something was not uh, proper. It was juggling in your life. It was creating pain, regret, remorse in your life. But now things are going to get restored with this healing card, all right, because you deserve the best and this is long overdue for you from the universe all right long overdue you can take it as a reward for yourself now i curious when you have come to this higher knowledge and wisdom that you are a soul all right you are here to bring light love uh, wisdom knowledge uh, you know to the universe all right offer that uh, that 
ace of cup kind of love to other creatures other beings uh, around uh, around in your life in your existence in this world all right bring that balance you know between the right and the wrong right ethics and the morals and the principles then unethics you know anti christ anti god right that those kind of energies that you have been juggling you have done that work and finally you are in a situation where you will be able to take care of this kind of an energy coming towards you all right you will be able to protect yourself you will be able to get that uh, guidance uh, protections from this kind of an energies and god will keep you at distance from this kind of people around you all right who brings this kind of imbalance into your life who brings regret remorse and pain into your life who inflict this kind of triggering moments into your life where you know you you get closed off you know you get into a hermit mode where you you don't want to meet anybody all right but whenever this hermit goes into a hermit mode when he comes out he is more knowledge uh, knowledgeable and more uh, highly um, you know creative and has a lot of wisdom right and when he comes out and that's the light that he shows out to the universe and this is what you this is what you are the the love all right out of all the depth of who you are you came to this light of understanding of who you are all right a healer a psychic medium a uh, um um a uh, uh, parapsychologist or you are a psychiatrist you are a tarot card reader you are a motivational speaker whatever is your profession however you are you still have certain kind of spiritual gifts within you that your touch can heal somebody your smile can heal somebody your hug your kiss can help somebody anything that you do touch feel smell touch, do whatever is going to really really multiply to you and it will be sent out back to you from the universe for all the good karmas that you have put in for all the hard work that you have put in you know <clears throat> that's what i feel for you no more hard time all right no more hard time a beautiful offer is awaiting you which will bring a lot of healing and peace within you all right uh, divinity and serendipity within you which will restore your heart with that ace of cup will bring commitment all right uh, you, you may get into marriage you may get into a reunion with uh, with the old soul that you have parted your ways with all right that's what i feel for you and this energy is absolutely going to be your past energy and this is entirely your present and future energy all right that's what i feel it's all about love it's all about love let's see what universe has to say for you acurius because i feel that this is a absolutely an amazing reading for you amazing reading all right beautiful beautiful energy coming your way beautiful energy let me see what universe has to say that's beautiful you see this is saying create space for new love with the ace of cup and it says create space for new love that means an offer is coming your way bringing commitment with this knight of uh, cups an offer is coming your way somebody is seeing the higher picture of everything trying to balance things out with you trying to heal things out with you uh, from this kind of an energy from the past where you had conflict pain regret remorse guilt you know all those dark darkness that was dealing between this relationship all right uh, that you were that put you into a place where your life has gone for a toss pause and you where you are juggling things out in your life lack of belief lack of trust lack of confidence all right those are now everything is going to get out of your life because universe is asking you to create space for new love and it says when a thing hurts hurts your eyes stop looking at it when it hurts your ears stop listening to it and when it hurts your heart stop justifying it i love you so much the universe i mean come on guys universe this is the ultimate ace of cup right the cup that is pouring for you from the universe all right and universe itself is saying that you truly don't need uh, to look for love from everywhere around because you have surrendered yourself to the divine and now divine is uh, definitely seeing your worth the kind of um devotee you are all right and after all the pain odds that you have gone through you stood up tall to love because this pile of uh, people that i feel is they are the one who love love okay that kind of a people they are full of emotions you know they see the world the way it is you know 
they understand other people pain because they have gone through that pain and they know how it feels so they don't want to give uh, make them feel go through that pain that's why they jump in no matter how sad they are in their own life they will jump in to protect somebody else so that they don't go that route all right and for all this that you have done you know when things has hurt your eyes ears senses you know belief system you did not give up on love you did not uh, you know justify onto certain things you just move on with the flow and that's the reason universe is saying that i love you so much the universe and when universe is saying i love you that means somebody else is going to come your way uh, to profess their love to you that i love you somebody is going to say now finally i love you all right and that is what is going to create that space for new love new romance new emotions reunion you know soul bond soul tie all right and uh, and uh, taking this kind of an energy from your life so that they can a universe can uh, you know restore that happiness tranquility equilibrium healing into your heart body mind soul all right so the two people can come together and i believe this two are you see this is the female figure and this is the male figure all right and i feel that this this uh, this has something to do between this two person and this two person are very divine being and two major arcanas here right uh, in between this night of cups uh, vibing with all these emotions emotional feelings all blue 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 color and all these three cards has water in it right one is tampering one is offering and one is just looking into the higher knowledge and wisdom of everything seeing things from a different perspective altogether and now i feel that this two person after all the healing has been done after removing this kind of toxicity from your existence you know creating that space for new love to enter into your life the ace of cup that you have poured out to the world pour out to the universe pour out to the creation in general mankind in general when you have brought that light and healing to other people around you that's when the universe is creating that commitment that engagement for you with that hair of and cut all right and <clears throat> bringing you that ace of cup for you to 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 sustain to to have in your life all right to start a new relationship that's what i feel for you that's truly what i feel for you some offers are coming your way and this card just jumped out from my krishna consciousness so let's see what this card has to say it says knock knock <laughs> knock and the doors of possibilities will open what did i say ask and you shall receive all right seek seek and you will find all right pray pray my dear beautiful curious pray this is not the time to give up all right you have fought long battle you have gone through a long long time heart heartache and pain now it's time for you to get that reward believe in yourself that whatever work that you have put in the good karmas that you have put in the uh, work that you have put in on yourself you know something beautiful is taking place something is knocking at your door you know and will take you by surprise and this card just jumped out of the deck when i was saying this dragonfly you bring light to this world what did i say you see what did i say you bring light to the universe you see my dear beautiful aquarius you bring light to the universe all right that's why that's why it was very important for two of the people out here or it may be the divine masculine and feminine within you itself which was learning to temper the dark side and the light side within both of you so that you both can march together get ready blend together temper together in such a divine way that you know together you can create co-create with the universe the best outcome of your life this group of people are in their second innings of their life all right where new love is going to enter their life life will get restored if somebody is seeing from things from a higher prospecting somebody is very much in their own divine qualities and power of knowing how to balance and temper things out in their life absolutely this group of people what i feel is that they are almost ready or you are on the verge of it all right it's just that you need to create some space for new love to enter because universe is saying that somebody loves you and the offer is coming towards you all right my cards never lie and these thing that i'm seeing right now it it is making true sense to me that this is absolutely past energy and uh, lord of uh, the sun god and the ruler of uh, atma is the sun right 
so your your uh, wherever your sun placement is right now in your natal chart uh, you know major transformation are going to take place with the transit that we are in right now okay and new beginnings you can expect as for the vedic calendar our new beginning is going to start from april april mid april right 13 14th all right around that time something major may transpire in your life something beautiful may take place in your life and it is going to really really bring a lot of peace into your heart body mind soul a lot of healing understanding clarity all right long awaited reward is coming your way a curious that's what i feel all right long awaited um rewards for all the hard work that you have shown you know and most importantly this group of people who loves love you know for them god will do anything to create a way for yourself you know which will give you tranquility equilibrium peace and happiness harmony abundance health wealth into your life and yes you know old diseases old ailments or old uh, garbages are all going to go out of your life this energy is going to get taken care of by the sun energy all right by the sun energy by the soul supreme energy all right which will really really bring a lot of joy and happiness love offer relationship you know cupid arrows coming your way cupid arrows <laughs> all right a curious i hope it resonated with you please take whatever resonates for you and leave the rest and uh, and if you're new to my channel as i said please do like share and subscribe and your one subscription truly means a lot to me all right until we meet again i'm sending across much blessings om namah shivai stay blessed